friends, happy Sunday. I hope you guys had an awesome and productive week. As for me, I had a productive and hectic week. From meeting to dealing with the traffic to running errands and the list goes on. However, today is a great day to enjoy some wine. So I came down to the Movie Town Mall located right here in Guyana to check out wine cellars. Let's go inside and see what it's all about. I'm here with Marcia, the owner of Wine Cellar. She has selected four amazing bottles of wine for me to sample today. I do not know where they're from or what they taste like, but I'm super excited to try them. Before we get into the tasting, I'm just gonna chat a little bit with Marcia. Hi Candace, and welcome to you and your viewers to the Wine Cellar. Thank you, Marcia. When I walked into the Wine Cellar, immediately I was captured by the decor and the amazing bottles of wines that you have here, the wide variety. Tell me, Marcia, what inspired you to open the wine cellar? So, funny story, I mean, most persons might tell you that, oh, you know, they love drinking wine. Yeah. yeah. And really, truly, that was exactly how wine cellar came to be. Yeah. What happened was, I was privileged to attend the wine tasting right here in there nice. um, of most of the wines that you actually see here. And I fell in love with the taste and the whole concept of wine tasting yeah. and cheeses and um, I thought hmm now this is something that can be explored in Guyana. Yeah. I mean we really don't have um, that kind of uh, exposure yeah. as a community or as a country to the finer things that in the developed world you will find other right. persons exposed yeah. to. You having been very traveled, <laughs> you would of course know oh, yeah. and experience when you go into a wine store takes your breath away. Most definitely. So I actually wanted to bring that very same experience to the everyday guy. So Marcia, tell me, what is special about the selection of wine that you have here? Well, as I have alluded earlier, yeah. when I started wine cellar, it was really because I had the chance of tasting a few of the brands mm -hmm. on my own. Yeah. So what is special about my, the wines in wine cellar yeah. are essentially the main products are products that I would have already tasted mm -hmm. and that I thought were exquisite yeah. and would have really and truly brought a different experience to the to the Guyanese palate yeah. compared to what is already on the market. Yeah, right? So everything here, it, I mean the brands are completely unknown. Mm -hmm. uh, they're primarily from um, Napa, wow. which is Wine yeah. Valley. And, and you know, historically, American wines were not a very big deal. Mm -hmm. And uh, in the last 10 years, they've just exploded Ooh. on the wine market. Yeah. So we've tried our best thus far to bring wines from Napa Valley. We have some from Italy. Ooh. Our plans are not obviously to stay within that, within that portfolio. Mm -hmm. We're looking at French wines as well. Ooh. We also have port, which is from Portugal. Oh yes. Uh, fortified wine, 19% alcohol. You're talking my language. <laughs> The whole point, everything in here, I can tell you, it has been tasted, yeah. tried by the owners from my oh, yeah. only because we want to make sure that what we sell is something that we would drink, yeah. right? And you just, you're not just putting on the market yeah. just for the sake of selling. I so there's that. a personal connection to every one of the brands Amazing. that we are I selling. I love the authenticity yes. there. Let's get into the tasting. So we're gonna sample first the Red Diamond Shiraz. It's a 2015 wine from Washington State. You know you have to swirl it, then you have to smell it, and then you taste it. But I was told that the Red Diamond Shiraz is actually relatively new in the wine market. So let's see what they've been up to. Ooh. Oh my gosh. This wine here, is a wine you want to have in your house when you're having your girlfriends over and you guys just want to catch up and talk a little gossip about somebody or something you just want to have this wine it's going to juice things up a little bit but it's really good mm. next over here we have the chateau semi shell the 2014 wine and it's from the California Valley. So let's try this wine. I was told that it pairs well with baked fish. 
but I'm gonna taste it and tell you guys what I think. Definitely a seafood wine. Mm. I really like it. I also like the bottle. It has a very vintage kind of artwork going on here. Now I'm about to try the Sarah. Take everything I'm about to say with a grain of salt because I believe white wine have this way of creeping up on you. But let's see what Sarah has to offer. Let's do some swirling, some smelling, spices, black pepper, currants, and wild berries. This wine is the wine you want to have in your house when you're mad at your husband or a friend and you just want to be in your own little corner and meditate. This is the wine you want to have to help you through that thinking process. Albiza Chardonnay Toscana. This wine is a 2012 wine from Italy. I know Italy and France are very big on wine, so this ought to be a good one. I'm getting a little citrus notes. Let's see how it tastes. Oh yeah. Oh yes, definitely yes. I had four amazing wines today. Wine cellar blew my mind with these selections. But I have two winners, one red, one white. Drum roll. <laughs> we have the Albizia Chardonnay Toscana, definitely a winner. And of course, we're gonna choose the Red Diamond Shiraz. This is the gossip wine and this is the pasta wine. Come down to Wine Cellar and see all they have in store. Thank you all for watching. Remember to comment, subscribe, and smash that like button. Also, you, as you know, my channel is all about bringing international exquisite experiences to you guys, my viewers. As a Guyanese who have traveled the world, I'm particularly proud that Wine Cellar has brought international standards and wine right here home in Guyana. Be sure to check them out located at the Movie Town Mall.